to see if that could be more cheery spirit. You want to go in? Yeah, you can give me two. Okay. Rider B. Yeah, I'll be Rider B. Right, ready? Who's riding in there? Hey, fella, I'm gonna ask you to put your hands up nice and slow there, right? Ain't nobody need to get hurt. Thank what you. the fuck is this about? God damn it. Yeah, somebody needs to make some money, and we're thinking about making a few dollars. A few dollars? You're robbing a goddamn farmer? I got fucking 20 cents in my pocket. Yeah, there's 20 cents in the right. money. You keep that lip up, son. Yes. That ain't gonna be the last thing you're gonna lose. I don't give a fuck. You don't give God a damn fuck. damn assholes. Yeah, right. Come on. Come down here and rob someone up their own fucking land. It's not your land, is it? You own this place. That's for me to know and you fucking find out, isn't it? Well, that is true. Come on. Stop telling me some fucking facts. Because there so is no fucking way man. I can win in this situation, and you know that. Hey, so why don't you shut your fucking mouth and actually be a little clear for, for your lap before I just put a bullet in you? Oh, I mean, your friend, has, your friend here is asking me a question. He's saying that I can win in this situation, and I'm telling him I don't see how that's fucking possible. Yeah, yeah, Fella. Right. Take your shit off and sort off that sad horn talk a little bit. I'm gonna cut you free, all right? Don't you try nothing stupid. Oh, don't worry. I don't want to get shot now. I ain't gonna try anything stupid. I've done everything you fucking asked me so far. Exactly. You want me to put my hands up? Yeah, we'll put your hands up. Turn around for me. Turn around. What? This way? Sure. Let me look at your fucking ugly face. All right. Oh, okay. Yeah. You got a lot of shit in here, man. No, you tell me you don't have that 20 cents he was spurring on about. Oh, hell, you can have the dollar, Jesus Christ. Oh, Mr. H, this fella is growing on me a little bit. I don't think he understands uh, the type of man you are. Is. I think I do, but but that's all right. You can have your assumptions. I do, uh, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. There's days where I question if he's gonna shoot me in the goddamn face, and I don't talk back. 
I mean, I ain't looking to get shot, but I ain't gonna shut my fucking mouth now, am I? <laughs> you ain't. Why well, not? Why ain't you gonna do that? Is that the only thing you have? The only dignity you have left? Is that what it is? Now, fellas, I'm not gonna lie to you, okay? Now, if I'm not back at that ranch promptly, there's gonna be a whole fucking gang of people out here looking for me, so you might wanna hurry this up. Oh, and I'm just looking him. out for you here, alright? <laughs> oh, look at him looking out for us. Can you see that? Hey, looking I'm out starting for to us. think we should just fucking give his shit back and we'll send him back to his precious fucking ranch in a bag. Yeah, I think that might be just about right. Think that's the move. Might be the move. Yeah, we'll like to bury him with all the shit he has on. You like that, right? You want to get your life killed for those fucking worldly possessions? I mean, I, I couldn't give a shit about what's in my pocket. I just don't want to get shot. But like I said, yeah, I'm thinking about I ain't going to keep my mouth shut. I don't know what the fuck you're telling me. <laughs> you, you t you're telling me to be quiet. You're telling me to answer your questions like, what the fuck? I was just giving you a bit of a heads up now. If I ain't back at that ranch quickly because people mm, are going to see I my see. crops are growing and that, I'm gone. So they're gonna know yeah. what's going on. So I'm just I'm just giving you a bit of warning here, that's all. See. Mr. H, is he able to be buried with his possessions if he keeps running his fucking mouth? Yeah. I'll make sure to start, shut the shotgun uh, on the hole, just so people know where he is. Mm -hmm. Oh, Baylor, I really wanna shoot you in the fucking head. Because I really don't wanna do with the headache either. Listen. I decide what I wanna do. You got a coin. Let me, uh, let me see if I can be of some help here, fella. Sure. Well, you all right with that, boss man? Yeah, have fun with it. Listen. Unlike my employer here, I'm a man just in it for the money, okay? I just want the money. I just want the valuables. Because I got people that I got to feed. I got people that I got to take care of. You're a rancher. You should know what that feels like. Am I correct? Uh, I, I guess, yeah. I can agree with you on that one. Okay. Now me, I don't want to see you in a fucking hole, fella. I really don't. I do. I'll just fucking bury him in it. I'd rather just take some things of value or you give me some information of value and we be on our fucking way. It's as simple well, I mean, as that. What kind of information you have to? Fella, we're men that lack money. We need information that might lead us to more money. Well, I guess I could tell you, gentlemen, why you, where you might be able to buy some fruit if you're interested. I'll take that. Okay. And now listen to me. If you can't find him, you ain't going to come back looking for me, are you? Yeah, I'll honor it. Change your Hello. tune, I'll change mine. If he's not there, then you're bargaining with shit that ain't of value. Well, what I'm saying is, he was there yesterday. I haven't looked if he was there today. That's all. Alright, I'll take so that. If he, Go on. And if he's spit gone, it. he's probably going to be back in a day or two. Alright, spit it. Alright, now let me just pull out my map here. Alright. Make it real easy. Mm -hmm. So, he's actually really close to here, to be honest with you. So, when, you, when you're going down Little Creek, there's right. a road, a, a track that leads up to Strawberry. Good. And if you're if you're going on that track that leads to Strawberry, he's on a cliff that's on the right hand side. So if you're riding towards Strawberry from Little Creek, mm -hmm. there's a little cliff maybe about halfway, and he'll be up there somewhere. Okay. There's a little house. I think it's just before there somewhere, but he's on the cliff face there. At least he was yesterday. Yes. Hey, I feel you'd be more useful and respectful. I don't want to kill you as much. I still do a little bit, to be honest. Waste this time. Okay, that's good. Hey, well, fuck, I feel like the uh, one more tidbit and then I'm ready to go on my way. What else you got? I need to make some money. We just need to know about things what. moving. Come on. I'll tell you, I'll tell you another you. piece of information. I'll tell well, you hold what. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, let me speak there, Mr. H. We're uh, going to let Mr. H speak, is what I meant to say. What's, uh, I'm going to say this. All right, that, that information, it was nice. It wasn't exactly money making and as I hoped I'll say it bought back to your uh, they say it bought back your Schofield there now we're looking for something to buy back that pump action you got yeah, what business me until you understand better make it juicy you won't give us okay nothing. okay all right I mean and listen uh... before you go spouting on listen 
you might think some people are your friends. Some people have taken care of you. They don't. You don't want to give any information on them because some stupid fucking idea of loyalty or something like that. I'm gonna make it real simple, man. There's only one rule that matters in this world, and that's the law of the blade. Kill or be killed. Survival. Okay. So fuck all, all those friendship and fucking favors and loyalty that you have to people. Tell us something that's gonna let you walk away from this mountaintop alive and with your belongings. Hey, if I don't think we would just be burning your town, you know? That point. All right. Well, I, I, I can tell you, I can tell you one thing. Yeah. Now, I mean, th this might lead to you, you boys might need to do a bit of a. Uh, bit of reconnaissance here but uh there's a man who used to own a general store in uh, San Denis and I know he fucked a lot of people over including uh much respected civilians like yourselves now he moved on and he's he now owns a ranch just outside of uh Rhodes there now he's changed the name of it recently but uh ranch he's a man are you talking that? about uh Eden's Edge or the other one no not Eden's Edge the other one that ain't being mm -hmm. ran by that field of Charles no more uh, I, can't, I can't remember what it's called off the top of my head. Uh, shit. Um, I know which one but, you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. Well, it, it burnt down, I think. But anyway, this man, so from what I understand, uh, his name is Mr. Westwood. And uh, from oh, what I understand, he fucked a lot of people over in this in this here state. I mean, you might know people that he's fucked over. But I don't know if he, if he wants people to know, but he owns that ranch now, and uh, he's usually a man that's got a shit ton of stuff in his pockets. So if you, you boys want an easy picking, he's the one to go to. And hell, I mean, the ranch itself is not very well protected. It's uh, a real piece of shit, to be honest with you. You can ride in there easy as fuck. Well, look at that. Mr. H, look at this fella. He's seen two, uh, you know, legitimate businessmen, and he finally gives us something of value. This is a man that uh, I think understands the way of the world. I think he does. I think you've learned something today. Uh, what was your name again? Me? So my name's Ted. Ted, okay. Well, Ted, I thought this day was going to end a lot more bloody for you. I'm happy you uh, changed course. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, well, you do were a mouthy son of a bitch here. Turn to make. Listen, who is it? Todd? Yeah, that's your name? Uh, Ted. Okay, Todd. Now listen, we're going to ride off back towards your pretty little ranch, there, okay? You're going to run up that hill to my left, right? You're right. You understand that? When right you hear the hooves stopping, then you can start walking back. So that makes sense? All right, I appreciate it. Hold on just yet. You were mouth in the beginning. In the way I wouldn't be a good father if I didn't, you know, give a few spikings or two, right? That wouldn't be too good, right? You need to be disciplined for talking back to people who are just trying to do legitimate business, I think. What do you think there, Mr. H? You know, man gets to keep his weapons, things of value, gets to fuck over somebody that fucked him over, I think, or probably people he likes. Mm. I think a couple of bruises maybe a couple of cuts it's yeah. as reasonable you know well, you maybe, say, Ted? maybe just one one good one right on the right side of your head maybe i'll get this ring insignia just on it oh that was my fucking balls well that's what you know you had a god damn you Is have to, when you see when you when you, you know it's the idea that that sun Tzu fella said right our deception there you go yeah well ted this ring there was a lob side the fuck of your head that uh I might get you killed by some folks. All right, Ted. Your, uh, your weapons and shit, Mr. Uh, Ted, are over there by that tree. Go ahead and collect them once we're away. All right. I'm going to stop walking up the hill. I like All right. I like you get smarter the more we went through this. Right, take it easy. Yeah, watch out. It's dangerous out there. <laughs> 